Tommy, here we are in the middle of what is a very tough run on the legs of the camp, but how are the spirits? How, how are the lads? How's everything going? Yeah, they're in good, they're in good spirits. Like you said, it's been a, a tough run of games uh, for everybody. You know, this, this part of the season, it's quite strange really within the first two months of the season, you, you play more than a quarter of it and near enough a third, to be honest with you. So from that point of view, I think everybody behind the scenes, that's the medical guys, the sports science guys and the staff have done really well to keep as many players fit and well and available for us to pick uh, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday. And we've only got one more, um, you know, full week, if you like, in terms of after the game on Saturday, we have the two road trips again up to Altrincham and then Solid Hill before a bit of a break midweek wise. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to being able to, to have a good full training week, but that's still a week away. Um, but the, the health and the, uh, the well-being of most vast majority of the group is, is very, very good. So uh, should have should have plenty to pick from. And another game at the EBB Stadium, of course, home advantage can usually help us push on. So that's always a positive, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, look, I think the last couple of games we've played there, once we've only taken uh, the single points, they've been really good points. I think we've played four teams that would have been in the top six had Southend not had any points deducted. So you've got to look at that. I mean, everybody was saying we only played teams at the bottom part of the table in the first month. Well, in the second month, we played everybody up there. So, and I think, you know, I'm not just saying this, I really believe we've been in every game. We could have won. We certainly could have taken points out of all the games against Chesterfield, Barnet, you know, and we did against Gateshead and Southend. So, you know, I'm really pleased with the, the, the output of the group. Um, would I want more? Of course I do, because I always want more, but I, I do believe they're giving me what they've got. And it's up to us to get it right, to get the combinations right on the pitch in terms of the different units and the different personnel. But uh, that's the hardest part of it, really. I think they all want to play every minute of every game, but they physically can't do that. So what, there'll always be one or, one or two you know, discussions on a Thursday and a Friday in the staff room. Um, and we, we'll eventually come out on Saturday morning and have the right group picked in our heads to, to win the next game, which this weekend is Dagenham. And obviously that's going to be no easy game at all, is it? Obviously they, they got the double over us last season, so that they're, they're a tough competitor. Well, yeah, they, I mean, I say to you every weekend, there's no easy games in this division. You know, you look at the situation off the field with South End and people could be forgiven for thinking that they're not a good side, but they are. They're a very good side. So there isn't any easy games. It's a, it's a relentless you know, schedule, particularly at this time of year, I think, for the, from in a league point of view. Um, but players will always tell you they'd rather play matches than, than train. Um, so it's onwards and upwards to the next game. Is that definitely something you see in the players that, that you know, momentum kind of carries them through? Yeah, I mean, well, it's their jobs. I mean, a lot of them, a lot of these lads, people probably might realise or might, and a lot of them have been in a high level of football um, for a long period. The thing is now, the difference is a few of them own the first team shirt and they've never done that at certain clubs that they've been at. Um, I asked the group at the beginning of the season before we'd actually kicked the ball how many have played 40 games in the season. I think only two hands went up. So they're, they're, they're entering the new territory, some of them, you know, there's, there's not many of them played every minute of every game. I think there's only three left now. Um, so like I said, there will be changes on occasions. Not everybody will be in agreement with them changes, but they'll be for the benefit of the group on that day against that opposition.